Hello. Today, I had the opportunity to introduce the people in the Office of Emergency Services in Marin County, where I'm the stress manager and have been for over 15 years. The stress management technique of EFT tapping. Now, I only had five minutes after their morning briefing to introduce them to this. So it was very great when the director ended their component of the meeting with everyone take a breath and try to relax as much as you can throughout the day. It was great because I had planned on doing the constricted breathing EFT tapping with them. That's something that Gary Craig, the creator of EFT, suggested to introduce people to it, have the experience of it. So let's do that together. In a moment, I'm going to ask you to take a deep breath and measure from zero to 10, where 10 is very intensely constricted and zero is you're okay, you feel good, you're breathing fully. Okay, now take a breath. And let it go. And measure zero to 10 how constricted your breathing is. Now, if you're feeling ill, please have that checked by your physician. This is for after that, or when you're feeling stress and you feel constriction in your lungs. So repeat after me, make sure your hands are clean. Even though I have this constriction, of my breath. I choose to feel as relaxed as I can anyway. Even though I feel this constriction in my breathing, I'm ready to let go whatever can let go. Even though I have this constriction in my lungs, I'm ready to release it so I can breathe freely. Eyebrow right where it meets the bridge of the nose. Tap gently. This constricted breathing. Side of the eye on the bone. This constricted breathing. Under the eye on the bone. This constricted breathing in my lungs. Under the nose. Feeling feelings in my lungs. Crease of the chin. Anger. Frustration. Guilt. Exhaustion. I choose to let go of these emotions that are constricting my breath. Feeling constriction in my breath. Feeling constriction in my breath. Releasing the emotions from my lungs. I can release the emotions from my lungs. Letting it go. Letting go of the constriction. Releasing the restriction. Releasing whatever holds back my free breath, letting it go, letting it go, so I can face the day to the best of my ability. Now take another deep breath and let that go. And notice how far your number went down, which it likely did. And if it didn't, that's fine too. You can do it more. Most people do find that their constriction reduces. This is something you could do during the day when you notice that you're forgetting to breathe deeply. The tapping helps relax your body. This tapping is used in the VA to help reduce symptoms of PTSD. Imagine that, that 
if it can help that, it can help release the stress, intense stress that people are feeling now, especially people on the front lines who continue to work so hard. And for all of you who are also not working to relieve the stresses that you're having, just this little bit in your busy day can help you feel better and be able to go forward more easily in your day. If you like this, please like it here, leave a comment, share it, reach me through my website, SuzanneAlfandary.com, and we can have a short consultation about how I might be able to help you individually with EFT tapping or motivational interviewing or training your staff at your agency or school. Thank you very much for all that you're doing. Be well and have a beautiful day.